So in parts of the world where rivers are usually contaminated with sewerage, we can find there's one city of 15 million people that uses its floodplains to treat the water that is wastewater and sewerage water that it's coming out of the city. It does this through a combination of sunshine, sewerage and a symbiosis between algae and bacteria. The wastewater which comes in about 95% water and 5% waste in this condition is then broken down. And then after that process of breaking down, the water moves into a series of fish ponds that then clean the water in a process that takes about 30 days. And on the edges of the city, which is actually the city of Calcutta, you can find this incredible wetland system and this incredible wastewater aquaculture system. And it's ribbon by highways and it's uh, flanked by this smoking escarpment of all the city's trash called the DAPA. You can find this incredible indigenous technology and it's composed of these 300 fish ponds that clean the city wa city's water while also producing the city's food. This innovation, it's not just a model for chemical and coal power free water purification. It also provides 100,000 jobs to the residents of the city of Calcutta. Given that Calcutta actually has no other formal treatment system at its core, it's actually the only way that the wastewater that coming out of the core of the city of Calcutta can be cleaned before it enters the Bay of Bengal.